today we're in Mexico with Minion Kinder Surprise Eggs. How awesome. But before we check these out, don't forget we are still playing our Finding R2D2 game. So make sure you let me know where you found it in the comments below. And stay tuned to the end of the video to find out who won our last Finding R2D2 game in our last episode. Happy hunting. Now let's check out these minions. And while we were in Mexico, we went on a kinder egg hunt and we found minion surprise eggs. I'm so excited about these. The movie is coming out soon and this box shows us that we can get Bob, Kevin, and Stuart. But I can't wait to see what interesting characters they've put out in these kinder eggs. I absolutely love these kinder eggs. They come apart so nicely. And our first little character, hmm, it's kind of interesting. Let's check out our flyer that came in our Kinder Egg. And it looks like we got a Vampire Stewart. That's awesome. So here are all the different characters you can collect. So we have a little stand in Stewart. It looks like you just snap the stand onto Stewart. And there you go. So here is our Vampire Stewart. That's awesome. I love the little fangs and the cape. It definitely looks like a great minion costume. And our next Kinder Surprise egg, we have what well, looks like a pirate. Let's check out our flyer and see who it is. If I can get the silly thing open. And we're upside down. Nope. Okay. So now we have a Pirate Bob. That's cool. So this is our second character in this set. So it looks like we have a little stand to put Bob on. And there we go. Perfect fit. And now since Bob only has one hand, we're replacing his hand with a hook. And we're going treasure hunting. You can treasure hunt a chest, some jewels, or some gold coins. Oh, that's cute. Pirate Bob. Moving on to our second minion surprise box. If I can get the silly box open. And we have two more minion kinder surprise eggs. And in our first one, oh look at that, our kinder eggs open up so wonderfully. And if I can get the capsule open, we'll check out our next minion. So we'll take a look at our flyer. And it looks like Caveman Stewart. How wonderful that we got three different characters so far. He looks like he comes with a little stand. So instead of sand, we have rocks and a club. I love the little bone on his head. It definitely looks like a caveman minion. Awesome. So our next minion will be, hmm, I don't know. And it looks like we got another pirate minion. Silly Bob, you keep popping up everywhere. And we did, we got a duplicate, but that's okay. More pirates to go around. So once we attach Bob to his little island and his hook hand, we'll go fishing for more treasure. We'll stick him next to the other Bob. And on to our next Kinder Surprise Box. And two more Kinder Eggs. Hopefully we don't get any more duplicates. Uh oh. Minion down! And our next Minion to join our Minion costume party is Stuart, our Vampire Stuart again. We have a Vampire Duplicate. Oh no! So we're gonna put him on his stand and check him out again. I still love the cape. Definitely looks like a vampire. And on to our next minion. 
I'm loving these minions. So our next minion, if I can get it out, bad minion, stuck in the tube, is another Vampire Stewart. Oh, three for three in Vampire Stewart costume section. Boy, they need to shop together so they don't end up with the same costume. And our last two Minion Kinder Surprise Eggs. We have hopefully no more duplicates. So we're going to open both of our Kinder Eggs and get our Minion Tubes out. And our first Minion is a new one. Awesome! So let's check out what Minion this one is. We're gonna check out our flyer, and it looks like we have Bob. It looks like we have a military Bob. This Bob reminds me of the Queen's Guard in London. I love the outfits, and his stand looks like a stack of cannonballs, which is pretty cool. I love the tall hat. So our last minion from our Kinder Surprise Eggs. Oh no, it's another duplicate. I wish we had found some of the other minions. Four duplicates is kind of a bummer, but we still got some cool minions. Well guys, that's all for this episode from beautiful Mexico. I had so much fun opening up all these silly minions, and don't forget to let me know where you found R2-D2 in the comments below. And speaking of comments, great job Jose on finding R2-D2 in our last episode. You guys are awesome at that game. Keep playing. Thanks for watching. See you next time.